my internet and also to my new subscribers YouTube friends because there's been quite a lot of you recently so yeah welcome this video was going to make more sense because it was going to be the first weekend after the end of January when most people have normally failed to some extent at their exercise New Year's resolutions it was gonna slot in nicely but you know I was ill but um, it should still work so I'm gonna go ahead with it anyway um, yeah so let's get started on my five top facts about weighted hula hoops firstly the main reason I absolutely love using weighted hula hoops is the fact that it's exercise I can do indoors I mean I know you can use like exercise videos and stuff but it's a really simple easy one to do inside because I find in the winter that's part of my problem is not wanting to leave the house again to go to the gym means I become very lazy. However, that leads me on to my second fact, which is you need a reasonable amount of space to use them. Weighted hula hoops aren't quite like your normal ones. They're fairly large. I remember getting mine. It was one that you can take apart to transport. So I had to put it together. And as I was slotting the pieces together, I was like, Okay, I have a feeling this is going to be pretty big. So luckily in my living room I have just enough space. But yeah, it's definitely something to consider. My third fact is that they're actually not wildly expensive. They're becoming pretty popular as an exercise thing to sell, which I think is helping with the price. I got mine off Amazon and I think it was only about £15. If I can find the link for my one, I will drop it down below. Otherwise, just a quick search on Amazon should find you what you want. They're also really good because they're coming in various different sizes, different weights, which means you can start a bit lighter and a little bit smaller if you haven't used one before and you can build it up. However, me and my friend both used them and she thought that the heavier they were, the more difficult they were, but she found mine, which is lighter, more difficult than hers. So yeah, play around with the different weights and see what suits you. My fourth fact is that it's a good toning exercise. I'm not entirely sure how good it is for significant weight loss, but it's definitely good for toning. It definitely makes you feel like you've done some exercise. It's good cardio. I'm definitely out of breath once I've done it, even though, you know, you're stood on the spot and most of the time I'm watching TV whilst I'm doing it. But yeah, they are. They're a really good toning exercise, particularly for your core, which is a particular area that I want to work on so it's really useful for that and my final fact number five is that it's fun if you ever hula hooped as a child you'll remember that it's a fun activity and that really helps for exercise and to get you started on a type of exercise because it's actually fun I mean like I said I watch the TV whilst I'm using it so I can distract myself from the fact that I'm actually exercising which is brilliant so there you have it those are my top five facts I hope it helps and be nice if you know some of you tried it out let me know if you do down in the comments below and as always like comment and subscribe if you haven't already I'll pop a little link to subscribe here and check out my last video up here